Since 2008, the Haiti Action Network has met 25 times, mostly in Port-au-Prince. Participants include CGI members from all over the world, from the private sector, small and large NGOs, Haitian organizations, as well as major donor agencies. In all, CGI members have made nearly 100 commitments focused on Haiti, which are valued at $330 million when fully implemented. My job, together with all our rapporteurs and members, is to keep everyone on track and make sure they keep their promises. Heineken is a part of the Clinton Global Initiative. In Haiti, this has resulted in a commitment to improve the livelihood of 18,000 farmers by sourcing 20% of our raw materials locally. Back in 2010, we made a commitment to the uh, Haitian Action Network to manufacture and distribute uh, 100,000 stove in Haiti. I am pleased to say that we are not only on track to meet that commitment, but to surpass it. AJWS's commitment is to support grassroots organizations to defend and develop their access to land, food and livelihoods. The Digicel Foundation made a commitment to build 80 schools throughout Haiti and to improve the quality of the instruction at these schools through the implementation of a teacher training program. We have completed the construction of 30 schools and have another 23 underway. We've also launched our teacher training program and have over 400 participants. UNO Social Business has a commitment to the Haiti Action Network to help build a social business in Haiti. Our social business varies from um, a poultry farm, bakeries, and uh, vocational uh, uh, centers. So in Vino's commitment uh, in the Haiti Action Network has been to deploy computer labs in different schools in Haiti and this project has been the Haiti Connected Schools which has allowed us to, to provide solar powered computer labs to more than 40 schools in different regions of the country. The Haiti Action Network gives access to a number of partners that facilitate reaching this objective. Being part of this network has been quite beneficial for us. It really gave us the credibility that we needed and the cloud to go out there and raise funding um, to not only rebuild the factory but to buy the equipment to move from an artisanal process to a mechanized process. Through the Haiti uh, Action Network, we have been able to meet great partners to share our experience. One of the key things we have learned is that working in silos is not a successful way of doing things and that partnerships are the key to success. This has been President Clinton's mantra and we are believers in this way of doing things.